Charlotte, the stingray is expected to give birth any day now, but there are still questions on how she got pregnant since there are no male stingrays around her. News 13's Ed Diorio reports the viral star is also doing a lot for Hendersonville beyond her tank. Charlotte the Stingray started out as a funny, oh, how could that happen? But she's turned into a national sensation. She's been talked about on many platforms over the last few weeks. And as a result, businesses in Hendersonville are starting to feel the positive effects of her popularity. It's just the buzz around and the restaurant and things like that. We're all kind of wondering her progress, asking if we've heard anything. Now millions of people are wondering the same thing across the country. There's a mystery unfolding at an aquarium in Hendersonville, North Carolina, a biological mystery. Jimmy Kimmel, ABC News, and TikTok are just some of the platforms talking about Charlotte's mysterious pregnancy. And those working in downtown Hendersonville are hearing about it. The last two weekends have been a lot busier than I feel like we would normally be this time of year. I've had people from like Ohio, from Florida, all kinds of places to come here. When it gets busy, we're like, oh, people must be coming to see Charlotte again. And Charlotte's 15 minutes of fame couldn't have come at a better time. Especially last year was really one of the worst years I think most of us on Main Street here have had. What's usually a slow period before tourist season has Hendersonville business booming. The like line all the way out the door happens during the summertime and it's been really fun to have that happen, you know, in a February when we didn't quite expect it and we have been so busy. Our neighbors West First upstairs were really busy the last uh, two weekends for lunch especially too. Again, with a lot of the families out exploring the town, just coming to see what what we have to offer but mainly for Charlotte. So, yeah. While many can't wait to see Charlotte's pups, business owners are happy whenever that time comes. Hopefully, you know, she can hold on as long as she can so that people keep coming. And even afterwards, I'm sure people want to come check out the pups. So it's just like created a lot of talk about our little town here. So it's been really awesome. The aquarium is open to the public Wednesday through Saturday from one to four in the afternoon. And you can keep up with the latest on Charlotte's condition at the Team Echoes social media pages. In Hendersonville, at Diorio, News 13.